so guys welcome back so in this video so in this video guys I, I want to talk about my experience of getting positive skill assessment in CEF and I just wanted to share my experience with you guys maybe it will help you maybe it won't you know like if you are looking for some experience or some suggestion maybe it will so i just want to say that i started working in kitchen from 2018 and when i started working in kitchen i started through washing dishes so i was working as a kitchen hand so that was like my first contract paper i signed in kitchen job that was washing dishes but later on i i moved on to the grill i started working in grill i was working in a kitchen as a, as a as a cook at that time so i changed my contract paper and i think this is where the journey started so guys like i just want to say that if you are applying for certificate 4 or if you are applying for skill assessment it is very important for you to know that <clears throat> you need to have a lot of uh, contract papers that you have worked you have to show that you have worked as a cook or chef you have to have your pay slips make sure you have a lot of pay slips and you have to have a lot of uh, photos videos of you working and reference later guys like yeah like make sure you have a lot of reference later whatever you work try to get the reference later done it will really help you and yeah like and then once you once you have submitted for your skill assessment once you are waiting for interview you know like pretty much like when i was giving my interview like guys like they were just asking me about like what i do you know when i when i am in the kitchen how do i start my day you know what section i look after and then i was just answering those questions you know like they were asking me about like first in first out last in first out and date tax they were asking me about like two hour four hour rules so if you if you know these basic sanitary things if you know the basic food and safety healthy rules you know the regulation from the councils and everything guys i think like you can you can do really good like like i was really stressed that i didn't know all all the food items and you know like i was not good at making desserts and all that so i was really stressed but uh, the interviewer like you know like so they were very very good on understanding your department and what you do in your department and the most of the questions were revolved around around those same things that i do in my daily life so guys like if you are if you are someone who is opposing for certificate 4 or like skill assessment so guys like i think like if you go through your daily daily things you do in kitchen then like you know if you know what you are doing there then you will pretty much you know like clear your interview so yeah i just wanted to come here and share my experience with that like i think like a lot of people they are looking for answer and like you know, if this video helps you you know just a little bit also then i'm glad it did so i think that was it guys thank you